Did you know childhood cancer is curable in majority of cases? I am Dr. Silki Jain. I am pediatric hematologist oncologist at Max Hospital, Shalimar Bagh. So, early diagnosis and prompt management are the keys to successful cure of childhood cancer. And understanding the warning signs of childhood cancer can help in early diagnosis. So, the most common tumor in children or most common cancer in children is leukemia or blood cancer. So what are the signs and symptoms with, uh, with which leukemia can present? A child with blood cancer can present with unexplained fever, which has been persisting since a long time without any evidence of infection. He could be having bone pains or joint pains without any arthritis. He could also present with some bleeding symptoms like skin bleeding in the form of red spots on the skin or bleeding from the nose or mouth. There could be pallor or whiteness of the skin over a period of time, which could be associated with easy fatigability. So these were the signs and symptoms which can indicate blood cancer. And second most common tumors in children are brain tumors, which, can, which usually present with severe persistent headache, the kind of headache which child has never experienced before. And this could also be associated with vomitings, especially early morning vomitings, because of raised pressure in the brain. Apart from this, there could also be some neurological deficit in the uh, form of loss of movement of any limb or loss of sensory function. So uh, the third most common cancer in children are lymphomas. Lymphomas generally present with lump or swelling, which can be present in the neck or in the axilla or groin. And these swellings, can be associated with other symptoms like fever, excessive sweating or weight loss. Retinoblastoma is a tumor of the eye in children and this can present with a very subtle uh, sign which is white pupil. Instead of the black, you see a white reflection in the pupil. So that can be a very subtle sign that the child might be having eye cancer. Apart from this, there can be some solid tumors in children like tumor of the kidneys, which is called Wim's tumor or tumor of the adrenal gland, the gland which is present above the kidneys. This tumor is called neuroblastoma and these tumors can present with accidentally discovered abdominal lump uh, commonly found when mother is giving birth to the child. Apart from the abdominal lump, these tumors can also present with blood in urine. So children can also develop bone tumors like osteosarcoma or Ewing sarcoma, which generally present with lump or swelling in any part of the body and which is usually painless and without any evidence of infection. So if a child has any of such signs or symptoms, please don't ignore them and take the child at the earliest to the pediatrician or a pediatric oncologist. Subscribe to our YouTube channel and press the bell icon to get the latest healthcare updates.